some fuel for the fire. Our word today is truth. Wow, now we could talk a lot about truth. We have so many lies the enemy tries to tell us. And Jesus calmly says, I am the truth. So often when we're trying to figure out, is this real? Is this not real? Just, you know, I, I mean, you know, my, my parents, of course, there was no such thing as the internet or a computer. And uh, my dad, you know, loved the newspaper. And, and I mean, there was a season that, I mean, if it was written in the newspaper, it was true, period, end of subject. Well, we hear a lot of things, but that doesn't mean they're true. Jesus says, I am the truth. How do we walk in truth? Well, number one, it always coordinates with the Word of God. It always lines up with what the Scriptures say. There's another angle of truth also, and that is truth is always aligned with the character and nature of Jesus himself. So I may have a piece of truth, but if I'm operating in that truth and I'm angry, or I'm disrupting something, or I'm condemning, or I'm speaking poorly about one of my brothers or sisters. I may have a piece of truth, but I may not be walking in the fullness of the character of Jesus. So we want to walk in truth, not as a fact, but lined up with God's word, and then aligned with the person of truth, who is Jesus himself. Let's choose to walk in truth today and know that that truth will always be birthed straight out of the heart of Jesus himself. Thank you for joining me today on Fuel for the Fire.